Hi, hello, my name is Carly. Welcome, welcome back to my channel. And today, just like right now, I decided I would film like a what I read in the week, working a nine to five. Yeah, so today is Sunday, August 25th. It is the last week of August. And I like, where did August go? Where did summer go? It's been rainy and cold all week and it feels like fall here and it's supposed to get up like we're supposed to start having some nice days again but ugh, not really ready for fall probably not gonna read right now i'm gonna take a little break i'm studying for my um like a licensing exam and so i just the material i'm using has like these live classes and i started studying like months ago and i just need like a refresher on this information before I continue moving forward and so I've been watching these live classes and I just got done with one. Take a little break, watch a YouTube video before I start doing some multiple choice questions or questions to kind of bring myself up back up to speed for today. I'm also in the middle of doing laundry and I need to finish editing a video but I do want to finish my book today. I am currently reading Jade City and I am almost done. I've got I'm only page 430 out of 495 so like can finish that today so I really want to finish that today yeah that's the plans right now also I got an iPad like I, I don't own any Apple products personally I've never had one I've gotten used to like the Samsung phones and stuff so I don't feel any need to get an iPhone and because I don't have an iPhone I don't feel the need to get in it like Mac or anything but I wanted um, something where I could watch my videos and take some more notes rather than just my Thing and print out a bunch of papers and stuff and I just watched my first video using my iPad to take notes and it worked great. I am very happy with that. Um, before you ask, I do have a case coming. I just, yeah, it's coming tomorrow. It's It literally lives in the box. Anyway, that's the plan for today. So let's see if I can get all this stuff marked off my um, to-do list. <laughs> starting an audiobook at work today for reading wise I don't even know where I'm going I think it's called the King's Trader it's the third book in the Kingfisher series I got I'm sure um 36 percent of the way through today probably listen to a little bit more tomorrow yeah and then last night I finished Jade City and then I started King's Trader today um really liking that so far Jade City I really really liked. Um, I think I kind of have the opposite thing where I feel like a lot of people, I, a lot of people, I feel like I've heard that people get confused in the beginning and then end up really liking the end and I kind of felt like I liked the beginning a little bit more than the end but last night I also immediately ordered the second book so that should be arriving tomorrow and then I joined one of those like fable book clubs and I also ordered the book for that. We're gonna read The God of the wood I think it is. It sounds really really cool. Kind of a little spooky, a little mystery, a little lit -ficky. It sounds really good. I'm really excited for that. So that's coming. Lily, don't you dare. There you go. So that's coming tomorrow. What I'm gonna pick up tonight, I think I'm gonna try to get actually start reading um, of Tempest and Tea. I want to read that and I YA so I can get through it quickly. But before I get to do any more reading, I am going to eat dinner do some studying and watch some stuff because I'm feeling kind of tired right now and I don't want to do like anything. <laughs> I'm 
I just bought myself more workout clothes when I'm trying on because they also came. It's um, oh, it's all Pop Flex Active, which I've kind of only been wearing. The only things I've been wearing for the past probably this past year. They I bought my first set like a couple years ago, and I've kind of been obsessed since. And I have a little bit more money to spend now, and. I keep buying stuff from them um but i think i bought kind of just about everything i would like to get from them but uh yes they are expensive this is not cheap but i will say the quality feels like so good like even the stuff i bought a couple years ago still like feels and looks good it just like holds up after multiple washes and stuff i don't know i'm so happy with like every piece i've ever gotten definitely not sponsored but this is so cute and i feel so cute in it like i didn't think i would be like in a escort skirt workout kind of girl but this is now my second one and i'm gonna love wearing this just as much as i love the first one i will say to anyone watching if you think about it if you have a bigger chest like i do i mean i look it but i do have a bigger chest the bras i always kind of feel like i'm busting out of them <laughs> like I'm doing like even just my yoga or my weightlifting and I constantly feel like I'm having to like readjust so that nothing actually pops out. I got this one based off of Sierra Schultz's Brutally Honest Review and her and another one on there so they liked this bra for coverage and yeah I can say that as a someone with a bigger chest this feels way more covered like I definitely can do my yoga and my um, weights and not feel like worried that my chest is going to pop out so that's nice and the skirt is just so cute it's I, I just really like her stuff say hi camera okay it's like 5 30 now I'm gonna eat my pumpkin bread and do like an hour of studying and what's going on Millie and yeah that is gonna be my night right now Jadewar and the god of the woods. Honestly, might start this tonight. Nothing exciting. I'm excited for this one. It's Tuesday. I want to say Wednesday. It's not Wednesday. It's Tuesday. And I just got off of work. I had to stop by the pharmacy. Might try calling the doctors about something, but I need to work myself up to phone calls. I started a Tempest of Tea last night and didn't realize it was about vampires and honestly I am not really a vampire person so honestly not really sure if I want to continue. I might. I'm a little curious. I'm not gonna lie. I'm a little curious but I also feel like I have a lot of other books that I like actually want to read that are not about vampires um, and so feeling like I might want to spend my time reading those. But I just got off work, like I said, um, it's almost five and um, I think I'm just gonna do some studying in that little area with, with everything. I also need to finish putting some clothes away um, and I need to do something with these books. So. Wednesday. I got home from work a little bit ago. Oh wow, it's five. Hmm, later, later than I thought. 
I am feeling really tired today. Um, last night I read a little bit more of... I'm doing a bad job at keeping track of how many pages I'm reading. Of A Tempest with Tea, I think I'll probably finish it. Um, but it's really nice out, not quite warm, like it feels very fall, but it's still nice out. And I think I want to go outside and read a little bit, so I think I'm going to do that. I'm having like a hard time with A Tempest with Tea, like it's YA, so I thought I'd be able to get through it quickly, and I don't know if it's because I'm reading it at night. Um, and I'm tired and my mind won't stay focused because of that or if like I'm not just I'm not vibing with the writing style or something but I'm having a hard time like focusing and like following along like I feel like my brain is just doing its own little thing when I try to read it but again that could be because I get distracted so easily right now probably because I'm getting distracted so easily right now um or like I'm tired when I read it um so I think I'm gonna try to read a little bit more during earlier in the day before I get like super tired. Then we'll see how I feel about it then. minutes 20 ish minutes something around there and I read maybe like one chapter but the house next door is an Airbnb and a guest family came and it's always so awkward when I'm sitting outside and the family comes and then I've got to sit there and like pretend that I wasn't that I'm not like gonna start staring at them even though I'm very nosy and very curious about who is now staying out there and for few days but it's it always feels so extra awkward when a family comes and I'm out there so that was the excitement for the night just did some yoga and then I think I'm gonna wind down for the night take a shower hopefully maybe watch an episode of a show maybe not I don't know we'll see Had to make a run to Target because the cat was out of food, you know, the essentials. And I told myself, I can't buy any books. Like, I am going on a book buying ban. I, like, may not have as much TBR on read books as some other people, but it's more than enough for me. And I only have so much space, so, like, no more books. I was walking by the book aisle, as you do, and realized business casual came out, so I bought a book. Also bought some cotton balls. Alexa, play Waste My Time by card. Alexa, level five. day weekend and I am so excited. I post period is just rough. Okay. I don't know what it is this year, these past few months. It's just been rough for me. Okay. I didn't really read much last night. Like I actually, I didn't think I was going to read at all, um, but I ended up doing a little bit of reading because this past week I've been reading my Kindle before bed. Like I literally will fall asleep holding my Kindle and then I wake up and it's right next to me. But yeah, I didn't think I was going to do any reading at all because I was having a very rough 
at night, but I did and it helped me fall asleep because I was a little afraid I was not gonna be able to fall asleep, but I did. But that's just how things go. And it's kind of been a busier week-ish. We have some deadlines coming up. And so I've been staying just like a little bit later than normal. So it is what it is, but it's Friday. And I think I'm gonna sit outside and rot. There might be some reading involved, but got a little bit of a stomach ache, probably from lunch. Um, and I don't really want to do anything, so. wrap up of this reading week not like my best but I wasn't feeling my best apparently so didn't read as much but there's still a good amount of reading done. I've realized since then that I have this habit of always having an audiobook something on my kindle and a physical book going all at the same time. Three different mediums means I can read three different books <laughs> but since recording that I have finished two of the books that were kind of mentioned in the video and let's talk about it. I guess to wrap it all up number of pages I read this week are gonna be here. Let's put it here. Look at that number. And the books I finished, I finished A Tempest of Tea. I did not like it. I was mostly confused the entire time. Every time I felt like I had an inkling of what was happening and who people were and everything, it went away almost immediately. And I was bored. I just, I did not care about that story or those characters and I will not be continuing with that series um, and I probably should have DNF'd it. I think even when I was reading it during this week I had thought about DNF'ing it and I should have DNF'd it. The other one I finished was The King's Traitor. Again it was fine. It had a lot more promise at the beginning of the story but by the end I just did not care. I like powered through the end, could not really remember anyone or anything or what was happening I think it's one of those books that would have been better read versus listening to, but I also don't think that my opinion on it would have changed too much if I had read it versus listening to it. So there are those books. And then The God of the Woods, I am still not done with, but I am close to being done with that one. I have about 100 pages left and actually I'm kind of hoping to maybe finish it today, but we'll see. Either way, I am enjoying that one more than the other two. There's kind of a lot of characters, which I didn't think was as much of a problem as I think it may be because I'm kind of forgetting who's who but otherwise I am it's a very quick read it's very easy to read and I'm pretty entranced into the mystery of what happened so that's that those are the books that was that week please let me know what you thought like comment subscribe and I will see you guys again with another video bye <laughs>